Hi, I'm Dr. Christopher Segler, and in this video, we're going to show you exactly how it is that we evaluate a patient and determine whether or not it's necessary to take x-rays for an ankle sprain. There is um, a standard set of rules that doctors use to check and see whether or not you need x-rays. So the doctor at the urgent care center that you saw likely would have done the same thing. I'm just kind of to show you what that is. The, the outside ankle bone or the fibula is over here, mm -hmm. and you've expressed that you have a little bit of discomfort behind there, but there's basically four places we need to poke around and see if you have any real pain. And if you have pain from one of five things, you have to have x-rays. So if we, if we poke around on the back of the fibula, mm -hmm. do you have any pain? It's a little tender, but not as much. Okay, you have some tenderness. What about yeah. here? That's tender. Is it worse, or is it worse here? Um, it's worse below. Back here? Mm -hmm. Okay. So you have more pain actually when I'm pushing on the tendons that are behind the ankle as opposed to the ankle itself. But if mm -hmm. we press on the back of the fibula, you have some tenderness and that actually by itself is enough to warrant x-rays. Here you can see where we press on the fibula bone on the outside of the ankle. Okay. Um, now if we press on the other side on the ankle, that's your tibia. And do you have any pain over there? Not, no. Okay, Not good. Really. And no pain behind the tibia back there where the tendons are? Mm -hmm. Here you can see where we press on the tibia at the inside of the ankle. Okay, so then on the foot there are basically two places we need to push. And if we, basically if you have pain on either of these two areas when we poke around, um, or you can't walk more than four steps, mm -hmm. you have to have x-rays for the okay. ankle. In terms of the foot, there are also two places. One is uh, right over here. Do you have any pain there? That's tender. Okay. We also press on the navicular bone just above the arch. So did they take ankle x-rays and foot x-rays? Um, did you see them? Did yeah, they show them to you? Or they they didn't show it? me the x-rays, but okay. we, they did do like one flat. Um, they did take three different pictures, I think. Total of three? You might have had a total of five. Okay. Does that sound right? That sounds right. Okay. I mean, I don't think I moved my foot five times, but... Right. Okay. Yeah, primary. you should have had five pictures because you've okay. got pain on your navicular. So when we push around over here, which you also happen to have some swelling there, yeah, um, that warrants a set of foot x-rays, which is separate. Okay. Um, the lateral view of the ankle, from, which is the one they take from the side, is actually the same for the foot and the ankle, so you can get away with the one view for that, but you, you should have also had um, a set of views specifically for the foot. Okay. The other place we push to make sure is that right over here on the outside of the foot, on the, mm -hmm. the base of the fifth metatarsal. If you have pain there, you should get foot x-rays. No okay. okay. Here's where we press on the styloid process on the outside of the foot. It may be helpful for you to look at a foot model to understand what it is that you're pressing on underneath the skin and what your doctor is trying to evaluate to determine whether or not you need x-rays. On the outside of the ankle, this is the fibula bone, and the end of the fibula or back of the fibula down here at the outside of your ankle is one area where if you have any tenderness, you definitely need ankle x-rays. It's also important to press on the inside ankle bone, which is the end of the tibia. And if you have any pain or tenderness when you press on the back or end of the tibia at the inside of your ankle, you definitely need ankle x-rays. When pressing on the outside of the foot, if you feel pain and tenderness when you press on this bump of bone that sticks out on the outside of the foot that doctors call the styloid process, you also need a foot x-ray. When evaluating the foot to determine whether or not you need x-rays, we will also press on this bump of bone, which is the navicular bone, sticking out and protruding just above the arch. If you press on the navicular and you have pain, you also need a foot x-ray. If you have any tenderness at the fibula, styloid process, tibia, or navicular, then you need to get x-rays. At Doc on the Run Podiatry, we treat ankle injuries like they are emergencies. Not only can we get the x-rays set up for you, but we can even see you at the house call today.